In the world of mixed martial arts, many consider Fedor Emelianenko unbeatable. Well, from a technical standpoint, um, I mean, he's near the perfect fighter. But Brett Rogers, an undefeated contender, is on a mission to upset the MMA legend in his hometown in front of a nationally televised audience. Inside the ring, I love hitting people. It feels good, especially when you get that back. That good, that good solid punch. Life has not been easy for Rogers. He grew up poor in a Chicago housing project, and back in April, he was changing tires at a Sam's Club in Minnesota while occasionally giving MMA opponents major beatdowns. He's going to get hurt. He's got, they got to stop he's hurt. Hurt. Big man is amazing, but. I'm not a patty cake fighter, man. I'm going in there and get the job over with, and that's it. If you can't take the heat, then you shouldn't have gotten the cage for me. He even showed a little moxie out of the ring at a post-fight news conference last year. It was garbage. Uh, you did tap out. When he you called out, out Kimbo out. Slice for his poor performance uh, against James Thompson. It's not like a challenge, big dog. No, no, hey, 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 no, I like no, to get paid no, for it. No, 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 But in June, he suddenly got everyone's attention when he knocked out former UFC champ Andre Orlovsky in less than a minute. Orlovsky is stunned. The left hook land, right hand left. He's done here. That win was huge. I'm pretty sure there was a lot of people that doubted me and what I could do. I was only for the win. The fans kind of put on a little, a little more pressure. Just went out there and did do what I do best. We stacked that chin. Life has changed hugely, man. Uh, definitely getting recognized. A lot of people approach me saying, you know, congratulations on your fight. I'm constantly going to the next level. Rogers is 10 and 0 with nine knockouts. But does he have a chance against Fedor? Everybody has a chance in mixed martial arts. That's the beauty of it. And when you're 260 pounds and you have four ounce gloves on, you are a dangerous man, regardless of who you are. He punches hard. If he connects on Fedor, anything's possible. Fedor has never fought in a cage, and that's one of the unique aspects of this fight. This guy. He's definitely proved to the world that, you know, he's the best at what he do. But I feel that I'm the best as well, and I feel that this is definitely my time, so I'm going to use it, you know, use it to my advantage. If Fedor has a strategy on Rogers, he's not talking. I'm not going to talk about that. That's a secret. If you would like to talk about that, we'll talk about that after the fight. For Rogers, whose life hasn't been easy, this fight is a ticket into the world of fame and fortune. The only thing stopping him, the greatest MMA heavyweight of all time. He recognizes that this is his moment and he feels prepared for it. It's almost destiny. I don't see me ever losing. So as far as can't beat him, that just doesn't happen. That doesn't exist with me. Please welcome the undefeated big-time striker, Brett the Grim Rogers. The moment of truth comes November 7th on CBS.